Boise Braves, and welcome back to KBHS TV. Today is Friday, March 6th. I'm Jira Bergen. And I'm Blake Ulrichson, and these are your weekly video announcements. We would like to start today's show by congratulating our National Ocean Sciences Bowl teams on a great showing last weekend in Oregon. Our teams placed first and fifth overall, which means Boise will be traveling to Mississippi in April to defend their national title. Way to go, teams. April? Wow. That is very far away. No, it's really not, Jared. But do you know what's even closer? Spring break. Jeez, I can't wait. Every class feels like an eternity. If only there's something to take me away. What if there was, Jared? What if there was? Are you looking for a killer dining experience this weekend? I love grubbing, and if you do too, come to downtown Chipotle tomorrow night between 4 and 9 to chow down and help our Boise High debate squad. By now, all sophomores and juniors should have completed the pre-registration process with the counselors. Next year, there are a few new class offerings that might be of interest to you. Today, we take a quick look at the difference between the two lifetime PE classes. Watch and learn which one is a better fit for you. Roll it. Hey guys, some of you might be thinking about taking a lifetime class. Now, there's two classes by that name, lifetime sports and lifetime fitness. What's the difference? How can you tell which is which? Now it's time for today's club and event news. Trisha, tell us what's happening. I'm Trisha Damaris and welcome to your club report. Today these clubs are made at lunch. Earth Club is in 205, History Club is in 504, Spanish Club in 427, Photography Club in 314, FCA in room 221, Paintball Club is meeting in 524, and International Climate Club is in room 204. This week, we are featuring Latin Club, which is both an amazing choice for an elective and an entertaining club to join. Check it out, amigos! Understand the base upon which many of the modern romances are based, an excellent case study of the ancient world. Oh, 
Well, this has been Trisha, and you're officially up to date. Back to you, Blake. Let's turn it around, Kieran at our sports desk. Kieran, what's the score? Hi, Boise Braves. I'm Kieran Arnold, and it's time to talk sports. Winter sports are wrapping up, and it is now time to get outside with spring sports. Last weekend, our Boise High cheerleading team did a great job in their district competition and are now qualified for state. Currently, they are accepting applications for next year's squad. If you have a lot of spirit and enthusiasm, pick up an application in the main base. Office. Last Friday marked the official start of spring sports with tryouts. Today, we are proud to feature some new members of this year's Boise High baseball team. Check it out. Homer T. Pitstain, right bench, dill pickle shell, bullpen catcher, Mr. Steel Yell Bass, foul ball fetcher, Harry Long T, dugout sweeper, bing bong, bench warmer, Fred Ward, you're out, bat boy, Johan Dinger, left bench, Randy Whiff, Equipment Manager. Adrian Malinowski, Pitcher. Our girls softball team opens their season with a jamboree on Saturday. If you are looking for some sunshine and softball, join them at Valley View on Saturday or come watch their first real game on Monday at 5 p.m. Good luck, ladies. Fans, get ready to come support our spring athletes soon. Well, that's your sports wrap. This has been Kieran reporting. Now back to you, Blake. <laughs> and now it's time for today's words of wisdom. We've all heard the story of the boy who cried wolf. He lied so many times that when he really counted, no one believed him. Aristotle, the great Greek philosopher, once said, liars, when they speak the truth, are not believed. In other words, if we want others to take us at our word, we must earn that trust. It's always speaking the truth. When we stretch the truth, we may not be taken seriously. When it counts, with something to think about, make it a great day or not, the choice is yours. So this has been Blake. And Jared. Shan, what's up? Thank you for watching Boise High. <laughs>